The patient is in stable condition and recovering quickly. The calf, Piat Noisko, as lab employees call him, underwent surgery on June the 2nd. A metallic motor was implanted in his heart and functions much like a heart's left ventricle. This rotary pump implantation experiment is another step in developing a nationally designed heart pump. We used to install the device on the animal's body so we could monitor its operation. But this is the first time we implanted the pump. The pump helps the left ventricle collect the blood which flows through the aorta through special tubes. A screw mechanism is located inside the pump. The blood enters from one side which spins the screw mechanism. The screw increases blood circulation and the blood flows from one side of the pump to the other. At this point only imported pumps have been used in Russia. The goal of Russian scientists is to design a more affordable domestic alternative. This router pump will help support those waiting for a heart transplant. There are also several reported cases of a patient's heart functioning reliably after the pump implant, negating the need for a heart transplant. The pump is used by patients waiting for a donor heart. Once implanted, the doctors prescribe special therapy to restore a patient's normal heart function. The number of patients who have recovered in full with these special pumps has increased dramatically in recent years. The calf, Piat Noishko, was able to stand on his own in only six hours after the surgery, and doctors allowed it to walk in the fresh air on the fifth day. Piat Noishko carries two batteries capable of 10 hours per charge attached to his body. The scientists are satisfied with the results. The next step includes design refinement and the correcting of minor defects. The developers hope the new rotary pump will be available on the market within two years.